Welcome back everyone, this is Arafelin playing Gone Fungus, and last time we found this challenge that I decided to not do just then, so let's try that now before I forget. I think you're supposed to crouch jump up here. Now that's why you need the crouch jump, because you can't spore bounce in these areas. Ah, wrong jump, almost made it. What did I do the first time? Alright, I need to up jump there. <laughs> yeah, I need more forward there. Okay, that was fairly simple. I just need the crouch jump. Yeah, because you can't score bounce when you're silenced because it's magic. Come to think of it, I should check back at the... Does it tell me how many ladybugs I have? Eight. I think I needed ten for the next reward. Those are just in the way. Switch back to my preferred spell. Works very nicely against large things that don't move much. Okay. Uh, just go through here. Beetle got taken out too. Nice. Yeah, this looks like it's connecting back to the door I saw earlier and didn't go through. Yep. So let's head back to the left and check the up path. I'm finding a lot of connecting passages and not much in them. So I should probably keep an eye on the ceiling in case there's a thing there that looks off. Because there have been hidden things in the ceiling before. Oh, that didn't quite work. That's filled in now. Yep, and changing screens does refresh your double jump, so. Oh, here's something. The map shroom for the color caverns. And another branch thing that's in my way. Okay, I've seen one of those before. I have no idea how to get past them. But it tells me I have 76% completion of the Cower Caverns now. So that's something. Alright, what did I put on the other one? I think it was in the ice zone? No? That was darkness. That was a key. Maybe I forgot to put any marker on it. So I completely forget where that other blocked off path was. I just know it there was one. Oh, here's a path I haven't explored. Let's head for that after marking something for this. Yeah, good enough. So, closest teleporter looks like here. Oh, now this one. That's right, 
falling doesn't hurt you, but it can stun you briefly. And, okay, next screen over, it's almost immediately down. Oh, one shot those. But the big ones are tougher, of course. Okay, it's just right here. It's a spot I've apparently never been. Looks like a challenge, probably for a ladybug. Yeah, it looks like it's just a bunch of boosting back and forth. Oh, those are crumbling. Silence, no dash. It's going to be a little tricky. Need to manage momentum better. So low bounce on that spring. Okay, that wasn't so bad. Let's see, I think the ladybug thing was up there by the main entrance to this area. All right, where else can I go? Well, that was the path to the surface out there. There's diagonal things up there I can't use. A gate from the other side. That was blocked, that was blocked. I don't think there's anything up there I can do. Well, first of all, I need to get back to a shrine so I can teleport. So, closest one will be back where I just was. Yeah, those things are mean. It's just up here. All right, and I wanted to go... Yeah, there's nothing I can do there. There are a bunch of paths I can check in ice caverns. Gold mines, also. Oh, there's this spot in the dark area I haven't been to. So let's try that. Just this exit to the east of that shrine I've never explored. And it looks like a challenge. For a ladybug. Yeah, I'm not sure if you're supposed to be able to do these more easily than... Because it looks like you'd need perfect timing to even have a shot at it. I'll give it a few tries, but honestly I'm not even sure if I'm trying the right thing here. Yeah, okay, so that went nowhere. Anything else of interest around? There's a door over here I haven't explored. It'll take a bit of a while to get there, though. There's a gate there that needs to be opened from this side, which is probably 
from there. All right, let's go left from here towards this. That might have been one of those piles of rocks there. And if so, I would need the Berserk for that, which I do have now. Okay, yeah, this just keeps going. I do not like the spike maces. You know what would be a useful power-up is heal while moving. That was just barely fuckable. Right. Let's hurry on while this lasts. In vulnerability as well as offense, it's Kind of overpowered while it lasts. All right. Um, okay, so the next screen in the bottom left corner. Let's see if anything new to say? Power and strength, line, discipline. Okay, you can parry this. Yep. This is the Berserk spot. So, new content here. Don't know if this goes anywhere, but we'll find out. back. Be careful with this and not go forward stupidly. Now they take three hits even with Berserk. This part just became super easy. And it runs out just then. Okay, path downward. This looks like it may connect into the gold mines again. Oh, those take a lot of hits. This is probably another one of those mace challenges. That I don't even want to try. their shots linger for a bit. Yeah. That did more damage than it should have, really. Yeah, that's two 
you though. Lots of swinging maces here. Nothing in the corner. That's one of those laser beam enemies up there. Get out of here, heal. Now this is circling back to the right. And not to the left where the gold is. Maybe another optional boss down here somewhere? Oh, there's a mini shrine. And there's a gated door there, so that feels boss to me. Let's give it a try. Ooh, giant ghost. Just letting that linger does good damage. This thing has a lot of health, and its attack covers a large area. I'm not sure how you're supposed to dodge that slash. Probably just be up in the air. Of heal. Okay. Looks like you need to dodge this like that. Okay. So that's something. Let's try the Berserk spell. Looks like going aggro on it might not be such a bad idea. Too bad to dodge. Alright, I'm out of parries, low on magic. Need to be careful. If I can survive for. There we go, the auto heal coming in. So close. Not just hang out inside the ghost that does not work. Alright, back to the shrine. 
see if there's anything I want to switch around in rocks. Uh, that's the auto heal, regenerate MP. Spike shield doesn't matter here. Knight's Trinket I don't think is a big deal. Try taking that off and putting the sword damage up relic on. Yeah, I'm just being careless. Flash, but you need to be in the air to dodge. Yeah, I'm definitely feeling the knockback without the nice trinket. I touched that. Yeah, I'm being really careless. Okay. I think I'll take a break from this, try it next time. Uh, does that show on the map? Yes, it does. Interesting. And there's another way down there I didn't go? Anyway. For now, this has been Aerophelon playing Gong Fungus. Come back next time and I think we'll take another shot at the ghost when I'm feeling a little more, uh, I don't know, refreshed, maybe? Yeah. <laughs>